Welcome to the Georgia Woodsman. Today, we're making curls and fuzz sticks for the Georgia Woodsman's Basics Challenge. Now, how to make really good curls? I used to think it depended on the knife. It doesn't really depend on the knife, it's just about your technique. If you start out and they're too thick, just readjust your knife, bring it in just a little bit. Some people like to rotate their wood. Now you can't get them too thick. You don't want them, you don't want them no thicker than your thumbnail. I make pretty good size curls and then I make some really fine curls because the fine curls are really easy to get a strike with. And then you can use the fine curls to get the fire and then you can use your, your larger stuff to just pile on top of it. Here's the junior woodsman. He'll be making some curls today. All right, I'm gonna show you how I make my curls. I find an edge. I just try to skate down it and I rotate my wood. This works for me, you have to find what works for you. To get them like this, it took me six months. They started out looking like tree branches and then they worked their way up to thumbnail thickness to even thicker than that to where now I can get them pretty thin. I to get them as long as I can because you can get a whole lot at one time. I couldn't make curls with this to save my life. And then one day I just sat down and I had to take my time and learn some patience. And now I can make really good curls with them. They're not all perfect. Now I'm gonna show you what the difference between a, a curl and a fuzz stick is. A curl is something that you go all the way to the end of the stick and cut it off. A fuzz stick you, you're trying to keep it on the stick and for some people that's really hard and if you get to the end and it gets cut off well that becomes a curl and you can still use it if you can get these really fine the finer the better the lot easier Now I'm gonna light up some of the shavings just to show you how they should work. This is the fuzz stick. This is transportable. At the last minute, if you need to move it, you can pick it up and you can move it if you have to. One method for using a fire steel that I like to do, and it works really well, pull my ferrule rod away from me. Get a lot of sparks that way. But sometimes when you have a, a big bundle of shavings or curls it's kind of hard to get in there and do that so i have to put it down on the curls and push down here i'm using the curls with the fuzz sticks to get a fire you can see how well it works 
And at this point, you put your really small, fine stuff on to get a fire. <laughs> 